things are slow going. Cindy's out there, right there. Uh, things are slow going, and uh, but I just pulled up a musket ball. Other than that, so far it's been not so productive. We're finding a lot of old, old caps, type of bottle caps and stuff like that. Uh, the, the soil is extremely rocky, very hard to dig. So, but got a musket ball, I'll take that. Let's keep going, see what else we can find here. Okay, I just found a musket ball a few minutes earlier. Cindy just found one over yeah, where she was at. I did. Definitely a musket ball, though. Very cool. Wish Whatever. there was more, but we'll take it. It didn't hit anything, either that or it was dropped. But that's pretty cool. Keep going. Good deal. Keep going. Keep going where? Looking. Huh? Looking for those coins. Yeah. Uh, I think we should probably move, so. No. A couple more swings here. We'll move on to another section. So, all right. All right, guys, I'm going over to Cindy here. She's got something. Looks like it's... What is that? No, well, something I wanted to look with you. Looks like some kind of hook. Some kind of hook. I want my glove on. I don't want yeah. to touch it. Sorry. Don't like dirt. <laughs> it's yeah. crazy enough. You're in the wrong hobby. You don't like dirt. It's a, a clip of... A look, take mm. a look at this. Cool. What is that to? Is that to like a belt or something? Maybe? No, you know what that is, Cindy, I think? Um, I don't know what it's to. Uh, I think, I'm pretty sure, and I've seen this on Tag Team Recoveries, I think this is one of those backpack, um, like a uh, buckle type thing. It was on a backpack for... Um, the uh, Civil War uh, soldiers. Oh, really? I think. Don't. <laughs> I'm not going to commit to that, but I think that's what it is, and we can check that when we get home. But that's a cool. If that's what it is, that is an awesome find. And we have found mid 1800s oh uh, stuff right here on this ground before, so it doesn't surprise me. Very, that means very we have cool. 18, 1850, 1860s coins right here in this spot. So that actually makes sense. Um, Love it. That's what I think it is. Wow. And maybe somebody can verify that. And of course, we'll do our homework uh, when we get home from this place. But that's real. That's an awesome find. If that's what it is, man, thumbs up. That's beautiful. That is cool. That's Very really, cool. really. Yep, I'm getting there. We're at a new field here. This is a kind of a virgin field for us. Been around it a couple times, but never really in it that much. Oh, that's a uh, that's a big musket ball. Take a look at that. Yeah, Isn't that's that a good one. Yeah, that's that's a big one. I like that one. Real white like that. That's look at that. That's perfect. That's beautiful. It's a musket ball kind of day. Which is like their <laughs> our third one today. Yeah. Jeez, Almighty. All right. Very cool. Oh, those, those, these are nice. That's a nice one. Yeah, that, that big, is nice. Big musket ball. All right. Yeah, there's a little bit of iron uh, in right in this area here. I'm getting a lot of hits. So that means people. Let's get back to it. All right, guys. I got something here. I don't know what it is, but it looks interesting. So it's right here in this plug. And I'm going to pull it out of here and see what we got. That's interesting. It's got a hole in it. Like a dog tag or something, right? Let's see that. Hey, Sid. Yeah, I Come here. Down here videoing. Yeah. Oh, this has got something on it for sure. Let me get closer to the camera. I don't really know. It's not a coin. Which no, it's some type of tag. And it has some writing on it and some sort of design maybe see that oh yeah i see the writing you're sitting on my coil again oh my goodness Just move it away there you go um oh man yeah i oh i see ss oh i see the e-s-s-i-n-g e messenger the S in 
Yeah. Looks like a G. Oh, there's numbers on the bottom. 326, 325, 326. Let's see what we got. This is pretty neat. Oh, there's another hole. Oh, that is really cool. Oh, wow. What is that? It's some type of tag. So it says the me message, message, but there's no R there. I'm thinking it's messenger. It's like M. I don't know if you guys can see that. Isn't that cool? This is some type of tag. That's neat. And it has a number on it. So that's like a, I would think it's like a serial number or something. So I'll have Relic. to check that out. Maybe I can find something online about it. Very that's cool. pretty. Well, I just dug up a pretty cool, what I think, um, I think I know what it is. Nice, cool little relic. Nothing too fancy. It's not worth anything. No value to it, probably. You know, nothing like that. But I think it's an old cup. See that, Cindy? It's a, looks like a handle here. A cheap handle. Yes. Yeah. And you can see yes. the rim of every, you know, the rim of the, what would be a, a, a cup. That is pretty neat. That's what it looks like, right? Looks like a cup. You can see that the, the, the rim right here, and you have some lines in it, like here, yeah. right here, and here. Yeah. And then there's a. All right, now this is a relic. Holy mackerel. Now that's a relic. This thing weighs a ton it's a big old sprocket <laughs> wow. came off, off of some farm equipment obviously yeah but it's wow i'm talking it's a ton <laughs> now cindy you came up with a uh a weird tool some kind of weird tool here and we're underneath this bridge right here unless you just found this Strange, right? Yeah, I'm not quite sure what it is. Me neither. But it definitely looks like some sort of tool. Yeah. I just found a penny, but it's real crusty. Oh man. So we'll see. Uh, not sure what that is yet. We'll find out. I'll have to take some serious cleaning to this. So, all right, let's keep going. See what else we can get. Okay, Cindy just pulled up a clad dime. I pulled up a clad quarter. And I just pulled up this penny. And I can't tell what it is, it's so crusty. So we'll have to look at this later. They're very, very crusty coming out of this water. Okay, let's keep going. All right guys, I just pulled up out of the water a weedy, my first weedy today. There it is. It's not bad shape considering the other ones are just beat. I don't know if you can see that. But there you go. Let me put it in my hand. Hopefully you can see that. It's upside down, but... There you go. It's a 56. Let's keep going. Okay. Cindy's got something. I'll show you where we're at. We're at a... It's a solar field next to us. It runs all the way up there. It's a big field. It's a farm. You can see the farm up there. But... Got some woods on the side of me. Cindy just pulled out what she thinks is a piece of crota bell. bell. Because you can see the little lines like the crota bell in it. So yeah. No, I don't see no lines. There's those are just, I think those might just be scratches or something. No, they're all the way across. Yeah, I see it. That doesn't look very uniform though. I think they're just oh. scratches. It reminds but it me does of a look crota like, bell. Well, I think it is a piece of crota bell. Oh. But, um, just a small piece. I know, just a small piece. The lines, eh, I don't know. I'll look for a bigger piece so you're happy. Eh, yeah, Thanks. give I'm me not, my piece back. I'm not so okay. sure. You know what? All right, I'm not bothering telling you anything. That's a OV, that's a, uh, a, a, a UBO. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. It's unidentified. No, we don't know what it is. It's a piece of crotobel. It could be a piece of crotobel, and I would agree that it probably is. 
but we don't know for sure. If you find the rest of it, I will believe you. Yeah, keep going. Go back and start metal detecting. Okay. All right, here comes Weedy Girl. She's yelling to me. So she must have something. Oh, she got a smile on her face, too. What do you got? Did you find the rest of that crota bill? Uh huh, look. Oh, good job. I did it. Good job. I now, where's that piece? Where's that piece go? Where's that piece go? Uh, this is another one. Just so, so we have three uh, pieces. Put now. it together. Oh, the other one. When you get hand. it all together, I'll believe it's crota bill. Oh. <laughs> nice, nice, I found the top. That's, that's that's a good piece to find. That is a very good sign. I am seeing some good signs on stuff, you know. Uh -huh. Some good signs. Um, that there's stuff here, people have been here. I'm over here now, which I believe this is a old home site in these trees right here. Uh, Cindy got something and she's doing good today. I'm not doing so well. well all the first, targets I've gotten is lead, yeah. usually slugs and stuff like that. Oh, it's tough with all the, you know, the shotgun shells and the bullets. And... Yeah, it's a right. lot of shooting out So here. at first I thought it might be a penny folded no. over, but it's not because I see Yeah, the I think shank. it's a button. I think I see the yeah, shank me too. too. Sometimes it's a completely rotted away shotgun shell head stamp and you just get the very top of it. Uh, it looks like a coin or a button, but that looks pretty perfect around the sides. Yeah, doesn't it? I'm gonna say it's okay, a button. Okay, so it's cool. It's by the, you know, what, about 10 feet away from the croto bell. I've been hitting that area up pretty hard. Yeah, it's a button. Yeah, yep, very I cool. See, I see the shank on it. It rang up as a shotgun shell. Yeah. But it was down there. All right. So I said, oh, I'll dig it. Yeah. All right, very cool. What is that? It's a UBL. It, it, yeah, it looks like a, a, at first glance, it looks like a, a musket ball, but mm -hmm. it's not white or anything. It's greenish. And it's not an acorn. So it's not lead. <laughs> and it's not very heavy. I'm going to assume there's probably threads in that, maybe, and maybe that's the top to something, like a, some type of cap mm -hmm. to something. Don't know what, but it, yeah, it's a UBO for sure. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what it is. Un unidentified. Buried, buried object, object. Yeah. yep UBO okay it's a UBO